So good evening guys. Uh, let me show you a quick tutorial on how to install this uh, Vivado. Uh, the 2014.1 edition which is uh, of uh, I think uh, 5.4 GBs or something. So uh, after install uh, installation also it uh, uh, expands up to 7 GBs. So uh, even if you don't have a internet connection like Wi-Fi connection still you can download it using your uh, mobile data. Uh, I think 4 or 5 GB is uh, sufficient. You, uh, it can be downloaded with uh, your uh, um, mobile phone. So let, let's begin. You, you have to open this Chrome, Chrome browser. Then in the Chrome browser you type Vivado 14.1 uh, and press enter. So it should open. Let's see. Yeah, it's searching. Con connection is interrupted. Why so? A lot of more connection. Yeah, so once uh, you search it you go to downloads you click on the first tab then you can see there are various editions available but you have to straight away go to vivado archive inside vivado archive uh, you will be having this first option 2014.1 right so here you can find this uh, vivado 2014.1 full image all os iso no you have to select the second one once you click on the second one, uh, it's a, of around 5.1 GB, then it will ask you to sign in. So I have already uh, uh, told you like beforehand uh, uh, and if not told that you can, if you don't have an ID for Xilinx, then you can create it. And if you already have one, then you have to simply sign in. So let me sign in also. So once you sign in, it will authorize you uh, the download access. But before that, you have to also fill fill in the credentials like Subham Rahi and IT Kurukshetra. You also you also guys give the same details: uh, your name, your email ID, and the, the company name and IT Kurukshetra address. You give the IT Kurukshetra job function student. And once you click on download, you see it will authorize you download link like the 5.1 or 4.5 whatever the download size it, it may be it will grant you access so i have already downloaded yeah you see the 5.1 gb file you you just download it guys okay once you download it i have because i have already downloaded i will not download it again you download this and once you have downloaded it you just go to that uh, download folder and extract it so I will go to downloads, uh, compressed, and this this is Xilinx Vivado 14.1. So right click on this, extract it. Once you extract, inside this you will have the setup. Double click on it. So now you have to just follow the on-screen instructions to install it. Uh, I have already installed it, so I will not do it again. So it will again ask you to, uh, it will uh, show you get latest, but you ignore it and you just click on continue. You click next, 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 and then uh, it will be installed. Uh, once it is installed, the next step is you have to open it. Like uh, if, uh, if it is installed, you have to open it by double clicking on it, right? So let it open. Now I'll tell you how you will get the license. Because getting the license, free license is also necessary. Xilinx ISC and uh, Vivado, uh, which is 2015 or earlier than that, those licenses are free. So how you will get it? Once this open, you don't do anything. You go to help. After help, you go to obtain a license key, right? After you click here, you uh, you you have four options like start now, 30 day free trial, no bid stream get free licenses vivado webpack uh, start 30 day evaluation so uh, what i require is the get free license you click over here and click on connect now once you click that on it 
this page will again open so this page uh, uh, the details uh, have already been filled by you so it will automatically take it click on next and once you click on next then uh, there will be a window where wherein you will be having number of licenses but you have to select the vivado free license i mean the uh, the the one you require let it open yeah see there are various licenses guys like 30 day valuation 2021 ai engine so because i have already downloaded that those licenses uh, those options are not available for me right so you just uh, click it over here generate node block license and when you click over here then automatically it will send the license file dot lic file to your email id with which you have with which you have registered in this xilinx website right so i have already received the license file so let me show you guys so uh, once you receive the uh, email like license file in your mail you open your gmail uh, and uh, there you will have uh, this uh, xilinx license see i have received three licenses the first one is th this first one is for xilinx isc uh, the second one is for xilinx uh, vivado and the third one is uh, like hls so all three licenses i have downloaded and it is in my download folder so next step i will do is uh, in this same uh, tab i will go to load license then here i will click on copy license and in copy license i will simply locate it uh, the license file and it will be automatically activated like in downloads i will go and the whatever the license file which you have downloaded like uh, the second one is for vivado vivado and first one is for isc so second one i will click and then click on open so automatically it will take and this uh, vivado will be activated right like uh, you can see my license status so this uh, analyzer hls sdk webpack these all are permanent and load node locked you can also check this certificate based licenses by uh, clicking over here uh, uh, just uh, on the for the first time when you have installed this whole uh, block will be empty so once i have linked this license file now i am ready to use so thank you guys this was the tutorial regarding how to install vivado 14.1 and the size is also very less like webpack web pack, web, web pack if you download uh, i think after installation it is just 6.7 gbs or so so it will be very easy and uh, the zip file is also very small let me see what is the size of it uh, it is of 6 or 8 7 gb so you don't have to worry much let me see it yeah it is just of 6.26 uh, gb so i think most of you will be easily download it and install it and get your systems ready before we do the next proceedings thank you very much